Let's now learn about numerical techniques for solving a first order differential equation. Okay, we already know quite a few techniques to solve a first order differential equation, but the thing is, not every first order differential equation is going to be solvable by those set of techniques. Okay, at times it is more important to get an approximate solution than to get a exact solution okay so numerical techniques helps us to get a approximate solution for almost any kind of a first order differential equation okay so the first technique that we are going to learn is the taylor's series method okay if you recollect your taylor series expresses your fx as an infinite series of f of a plus x minus a into f dash a x minus a square upon 2 factorial into f double dash a and so on okay so you have your f of x expressible like this let's just say that I give you a differential equation which is like this dy by dx is equal to capital F of x comma y okay so what you essentially have is you have your y dash equal to this okay and what is your y y equal to f of x is the solution of this differential equation okay you need to find out why right you can do that with the help of this taylor's series method let's just say that i also give you a initial condition saying that y at x zero is equal to y zero okay so if you have this initial condition then essentially what you have is you have f at x0 is equal to y0 right because what is y y is essentially a function of x which is the solution of this de so you have f of x0 equal to y0 so over here you can just substitute a equal to x0 okay let's just see what do we get i have y equal to f of x which is my solution which is equal to f of x0 plus x minus x0 f dash a what is f dash a f dash a is simply y dash a okay do you know y dash a you know y dash a because you have y dash as this function just put x equal to a in that okay and then you are going to have more terms x minus x 0 whole square upon 2 factorial f double dash a or f double dash x 0 okay this is also x 0 do you know f double dash you know f double dash because your y dash is this therefore your y is f right your y dash is f dash and your y double dash is f double dash okay and if you want to find out your f double dash or y double dash all you have to do is differentiate this guy with respect to x okay if you want to find out your y triple dash differentiate it two times okay and so on so in this particular series everything is known to you f of x0 is part of the initial condition and x0 is anyways known and all these first order second order third order derivatives can be found out by differentiating the given function of x and y okay so you can calculate the y at any given x using this 